Chase two. Let go. Yeah, yeah. This is Shades 2, and I'm back again, bringing a brand new haul to all my friends. Been to all types of stores like DT and many, many more. Bringing you all types of deals that only Shay Shay calls substitute. This is Shades 2, and I'm back again. This is Shades 2, and I'm back. Shades 2, and I'm back again. This is Shades 2. And I'm back, all right now. This is Shades 2, and I'm back again. This is Shades 2, and I'm back. Like and subscribe. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, y'all, for tuning in. This is Shades 2. Yeah. I'm lit, y'all. I'm lit for show. All right now. Yeah, yeah. Shades 2. Hey guys, welcome to Shades Tube. It's a rainy but beautiful Saturday afternoon. Happy and blessed Easter weekend. Happy and blessed Easter to you guys. And thank you so much for tuning in. Y'all, I got a lot of stuff from a lot of different stores because y'all know I just moved and I'm buying stuff to decorate and just change up things. It's taken me so long to do this house though, you know, with me working and things like that. But I've definitely been buying stuff, you know, to just make everything look a little bit different. And I want to show you guys some of the steals that I found from different stores like Dollar Tree, Burlington, Hobby Lobby, Walmart, Five and Below. All right. And anywhere else that I shop that I feel like I needed to show you guys. All right. So don't forget to thumbs up this video, y'all. Let me do it like that. Subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. And hit the bell notification so you can be notified of any upcoming videos. Check my lives out Monday through Friday different times usually they come on late night but at times i do lives earlier for people who you know can't make the late night um lives also check out my shorts and follow me on tiktok at shades too while it's up all right so anyway happy born day to all of my march babies my birthday was last week so you know it is what it is i had a good time y'all i got a lot of little gifts Oh man, I just had a good time. I really did. And I've been, I was eating so much chocolate, not well, not so much chocolate cake, but I was eating so much, you know, ice cream, chocolate cake, just all types of goodies. I really did enjoy my birthday and my birthday week. And I, again, I want to say thank you to everybody who wished me a happy birthday. Thanks to all who gave me a gift and thanks to all who just made this day a beautiful experience. All right. And I'm blessed to see another beautiful, healthy, energetic, youthful, you know, birthday. All right. Thank y'all again. So let's go ahead and go start off with this haul. First thing first, you know, we're going to hit up Dollar Tree. From time to time, I have to put this video on pause because I got a lot of stuff and I have to put it on my bed. I'm in limited space here on my bed because I'm still trying to fix up everything. It's hard trying to redecorate, unpack and work and do everything else too. But eventually I'll get this all done. Trust me. I'm going to get myself to meet to the middle part of April and this whole house should be done. All right. So anyway, y'all, I had to go get some of these baskets at Dollar Tree. Okay. Excuse my nails. I still got to go get them done. Um, so anyway, I got some baskets at Dollar Tree for my kitchen underneath the cabinet. Because for me, I just found it to be more, you know, better if you put, you know, your um, cleaning products or whatever inside of baskets to keep everything organized and neat. And it just makes it look overall more organized and more beautiful. All right. So I got like five of these. I also picked up some of, some more of these um, wall creations because I actually put these in my bathroom. And the thing about it, I got these right here from from Walmart for five dollars. These things right here come off the walls. Okay, now I couldn't find the the receipt for this one. This is the reason why I still have this one. But if I find it today, this one is going back, and I'm gonna go back to Dollar Tree and get some more butterflies like this, probably in the silver color though. And I do have some of these inside my boxes and stuff, but I have to get to that first. So until then, I'm just gonna buy some if I see them at um, Dollar Tree. Or somewhere else other than Wally World. All right. I also picked up some of this Sure Sense. I picked up a lot of these because this stuff right here smells good. I mean, it just keeps everything fresh smelling. And if there's a little machine that goes in, but I don't really think I want to get that this time because it, sp it sprays out a lot. I don't want to spray too many aerosols throughout the air, you know, too many times per day. So I just get these and just spray them myself every so often. And this is compared to um, 
you know, the other one like this, which is the, um, I think it's the Airwick dispenser. And you can use it in the Airwick dispenser as well. I also picked up some Dove soap. This is to fill up any um, nail holes that I made in a wall or tack holes. This Dove right here, though, is for my son. It's sensitive skin, so I picked up him one, an extra one. Because, again, all of my stuff is still in boxes. Not everything, but a lot of things are still in boxes, so we can't find certain things. So I just find it easier, easier just to go out and get some more. All right, let me put you guys on hold real quick. I actually I actually think that's all of Dollar Tree stuff, but I did get some more of this um, fingernail polish right here. The touch up to do my nails until I go get them done because I don't I don't really like walking around like this and I don't know why people be telling me my nails look good I guess they don't see the entire nails I don't know because they need to be done all right and I just haven't had a chance or anything to go get it get them done yet but so I bought this from Dollar Tree because I do know this this fingernail polish right here stays on a little bit you know and I got this so I can go ahead and do my nails until I go get them professionally done again. And since these are my actual nails, I don't have to worry about no, you know, putting nails on. I just need to take this mess off right here, which is hard to take off. I may go and let them take this off real quick. I don't know. If I do that, then they're going to want to do my nails. But, you know, I got so many things to um, pay for right now. Not only I don't have time to be sitting there for no hour, I just, you know, I got other more important things to do. And I know I do my nails pretty good. So that's why I got this. I also got my OPI stuff. But that stuff comes off so quick. So I'm like, I probably won't even buy any more OPI. I got so many bottles of it anyway. I mean, so many. So I'm just going to basically use all of that up and probably just go get my nails done every two weeks or so. Because did the gel polish, y'all, it lasts for a long time. If this was, if my nails didn't grow so quick, this would still look okay and I would probably could just touch it up. But my nails grow pretty quick, so it is what it is. But yeah, so if you see this, go ahead and try. Put um, If you got OPI top coat or another expensive nail polish top coat, you can put that on top of this and it, and it may stay on a little bit longer. All right. So the next thing that I'm going to show you guys, I think I'm done with Dollar Tree. I want to show y'all this cute little thing right here that I got from Burlington. All right. Let's see. Cause I always forget Burlington. All right. So this comes in different colors. It comes in gray and red. I think those are the only colors besides this one. And I just wanted something to, you know, go in, go with my whole entire, color theme throughout my place and my kitchen is blue so therefore that's why i picked this up this y'all is only 12.99 at burlington you cannot beat that because if you buy this at any other store you are going to pay way and i mean way 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 more uh, don't sleep on burlington y'all i'm telling you straight up because if you do you're gonna miss out on steals like this simply simply cute man i love it and then it has the little thing right there to open it. You know, just keep it clean, dry it out. It won't rust. I just got it for decor because we don't really drink. I don't really use it. You know, my, my girls or my son may use it, but I don't use it. Okay, let's go ahead and get the rest of Burlington stuff out. So here, guys, I picked up a nice little cute seat um, strainer. And I just like the way this is designed, okay, the shape and everything. So that's why I picked this up. And then the black color, they, didn't, they did not have gray like this. Or even blue, so I had to pick up this one, and it was it was only two ninety nine at Burlington. So I think this is a this is a steal. I really do. And again, I like how it's designed. And if this does not fit, then I'm gonna take it back. But if it does fit, I'm keeping it. I also picked up this beautiful picture for my son's bathroom, cause his bathroom is black and white. So I wanted something to go with that. And then I like what it says: "Wash your hands, you filthy animal." It was only ninety nine ninety nine. You know, so we like silly stuff like this. So we pick, I picked this up. Let me see the hooks on that. I hope it has those. Where it, oh, gosh. It has these. I hate when they have hooks like this. One on each side. Because you have to measure this and stuff. I think that's one. No, there's one on this side. And then there's one on this side. But I'll get it up there. It's just more work. You know, you have to measure and stuff like that. Sorry about the shaking camera. Y'all know I'm holding it. So let's just. Let's just put that right there. I want to break that picture because it's glass. Another picture that I got, y'all, is this other picture for my bathroom. It's $7.99. Y'all know I like the animals. So I had to get, an, you know, the animals in the tub. It's so super cute. I can't wait to hang that up. And once again, it has the same hooks on the back. Ugh. Okay, but with this, at least you can hang it up from here. It'll still stay um, level if you do it the right way. And then another thing that I got from Burlington is this four-tier shoe rack this y'all was only 10 
or eleven dollars. And I am so happy because I did not want to spend on no seventeen, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty dollars for a shoe rack that's going inside of my uh, closet. This is gray, so it matches my gray chair over there, the brand new one that I bought. And I'm going to put some shoes on here. I mean, I can't get all of them on there because I have a lot of shoes. But for the ones, I may go get a second one just because I don't want to take up all my space in my closet either. But for the time being, I'm going to put some on here. Um, I don't know how many pairs of shoes this holds, but it holds a lot. So the rest of them are going to go inside my little shoe boxes that I bought from Dollar Tree. And I'll just probably, I may, if I get a chance, I may bling bling them or just make them look more better. Or I may even just go to a different store. And really get some nice ones to put my shoes in. You just never know, you know. So I think that's that is all from Burlington, if I'm not mistaken. Let me show y'all what I got from Hobby Lobby. Y'all, y'all know my son's room is also gaming theme and also boxing theme and basketball. So I picked him up this Pac-Man thing right here. What is this anyway? It's just a, it's just a it's just this y'all. Okay, and it was six ninety nine. And it's super cute to go in this room on his desk with, with his gaming computer. And y'all know I had to pick up some costume jewelry like always. I mean, I picked up some more costume jewelry too, but I just didn't show you guys. Anyway, this right here is from Hobby Lobby. These bracelets, they were on sale. They were, they were, they're not on sale. They, they are just $6.99. So super, super cute. They don't fade quick either. Hobby Lobby stuff does not fade quick like some of these other little um, stores with their little inexpensive jewelry. Okay, so at five and below, y'all, I picked up this light up beanbag toss because I'm going to have like a little game area in part of my house somewhere. And I got this. I got my tic-tac-toe stuff. I got my chest. Um, we got Connect Four. We got cards, Unos. So this I add to it. This is a fun game to play. You want to get some exercise on. You can play this game and incorporate this, you know, use this for exercise if you're throwing it, you know, for your arms and stuff and, you know, going to get in things like that. I put exercise into everything. Y'all just don't know. So that's from five and below. This was only, I think this was $5.55 if I'm, if I'm not mistaken. And if it wasn't, it was $10. All right. Then I think, I don't know if I showed y'all this umbrella before because I bought it last week and forgot to show you guys. I picked this up at Burlington and it was $9.99. I've been looking for a nice umbrella for the longest because it's like rainy. And every time I see one, it's like 20 30 40 dollars i was like i'm not paying on 20 or 30 or 40 dollars on an umbrella that if the wind blow hard enough it'll mess it up so when i saw this i wish it would have been in pink or something like that but yellow works and yeah it works and it's traditional for the rain so it would go good i just need to get a rain coat to match it but anyway i like it it's simply cute for 10 dollars you can't beat it and that is at burlington as well now let me show you the other stuff that i got so y'all this is a mixture right here because i got this little planner and the only reason I bought it because I like the design and this can add some flair to my desk and I can go ahead and write stuff in it anyway you know for the rest of this year just planning out stuff if I don't want to go inside of my purse or if I want to get away from writing stuff on my calendars that are up on my wall because it kind of looks tacky when you put calendars up and you have writing all over it so I decided to pick this up since it was on sale clearance for two dollars it's normally way more than that. Uh, I don't know how much it normally is, but I know it's more. This is simply cute, though. I love this. They had a smaller one, too, the regular organizer. But I wanted this, you know, because it's just, you know, we'll go in with my little mouse pad that I got over there. And it just, you know, will complement that area over there where my desk will be, where it is right now. And then where my um, ring light will go. I, like, I got like three or four little ring lights, but I'm only going to put up one and just leave it up all the time. Maybe two. I got two that I will stay up the entire time. Because y'all know I got mini ring lights. I got the table ones. I got the one that you attach to yourself. I got the the regular ones. And then I got um, a couple of those. And then I got a smaller one. So the two two of them I will leave up. One of them is like a pink color. A color, it goes with this. So my room basically will have just a hint of pink in it. But it's mostly blue in here. All right. And when I get through with everything, I will show you guys. And another thing, we are having a contest we're going to see who's going to decorate their rooms the best. So when I get, when everybody gets done, I'm going to show everybody the rooms and let y'all vote. My daughter is winning so far. You know what I'm saying? My other daughter. So I don't know. I may not win. I don't know y'all because she, she be spending some money. My ass is cheap. You know what I'm saying? And I got all this shit. I be having stuff everywhere. I'm going to try to organize it right now because they be making jokes about all this shit I be having. Just be doing too much. Anyway, I picked this up at um, five and below. 
I didn't want this one for real, for real, but he likes, um, this is um, Michael Jordan. So I went on and picked it up to put this in his room because this room is not my room. So I basically decorated the way he wants to. Posters at five and below are only five fifty five. At Walmart, posters are like eleven, fifteen, twenty dollars. Okay, so of course I got this there. But when I go get Muhammad Muhammad Ali, I'm definitely going to probably order that on Amazon because it's probably going to be a lot for him because he's into boxing, which I hate. I hope he don't actually do it, but he said he was. So the next bag, and I think this is the last bag, and I need to hurry up anyway. This is from y'all don't even know at home. I think at home. So it is. So hold on, y'all. Let me get this. Hold on. Shout out to Brown Sweet for giving me a nice little gift card from at home for my birthday. I went out to at home store and y'all, I picked up this gorgeous little um, kitchen rug. I only got one rug in my kitchen. Right now I have a gray one that matches still, but I wanted to just bring in the blue. So I'm taking the gray one up and I'll probably just wash it and put it up, you know, but this rug is absolutely gorgeous. It was only $7.99 at the at home store, as you can see. So there you go. Then I picked up some daisy daisies since I can't get the real ones because I don't know if these are poisonous to my cat. And plus, she just does too much with flowers. I decided to get this for my bedroom because I love plants, whether they are real or faux. Um, and uh, when I saw this, it just caught my eye and especially the price three ninety nine at at home store. Simply, simply cute. That is pretty. This is my favorite item right here of this entire haul. I'm just going to tell you guys that right now. Then I picked up my son a bath scrubber thing, you know, toilet brush thing, cleaner. And this was only $10 at the at home store. I don't know what color the brush is because I forgot to take it open. Let me see. Okay, y'all. Okay. At home store doing it up. All right. So when I open this up, this was inside of it. You can actually clean your toilet and drink from it at the same time. I'm just... <laughs> Honestly, this is in here like this. I guess it's for when the brush goes in here. I'm, I'm thinking, and uh, I guess that's what that's in there for. I don't know. Anyway, I don't. I, I don't know. I mean, I guess it is. Look, see. So you can just so you won't get this part dirty, and then I guess you can just re rinse this out and clean it, and then just get another brush if you want and put it in. I don't know. Okay, but I think it's, it's this is a cute idea. I actually like this better because it wants to get dirty. Nah, it goes in here because it, it fixes better. Let's see. It's the tag is on it, but hold on. Let me see. So actually, it fixed pretty good in there without this. And honestly, um, I don't know if we're going to use this for that. I don't know. Because I think this would be a problem for him. But it, it's still fixing it good. But at the same time, if you put this back inside of here like this, it goes on there. Well, no, it still does the same thing. So I don't know if I'm going to use the insert. I find it kind of weird that they have one in there. But it is what it is. Hold on, y'all. It is what it is. So I don't know if I'm going to use this insert or not. I can use that for something else. But this will go in his bathroom. His bathroom is so super cute. It's black and white. When I finish with it, of course, I'm going to show you guys. He wanted his room in his bedroom, his bathroom in his bedroom to be black and white. And I definitely did that. Let me see what this says. It says a toilet bowl, brush, and holder. Okay, so I guess the other thing does just stay inside of there. And you um, put the thing inside of here instead of, instead of being inside of there. So I guess I'll leave it in there like they got it. And you can just put it inside of that little thing and it'll probably work out better. Yeah, I'll just leave it like that. And this was only $9.99. Of course, they have some that cost even more. But of course, I wasn't going to spend too much for no bath um, a toilet uh, bowl brush and holder. Because, you know, once this gets messed up, you, what you going to do? It's probably going to be hard to find one that fits this with this on it. And you can't take this. Maybe you can unscrew this brush. But who wants to touch this? You know, and then... I, I don't know. I would just replace it and go from there. And then the last item that I picked up from Hobby Lobby, y'all, is this gorgeous pen. Y'all know I already got another one, and I just bought this for a backup. They used to have the gold one, and everybody took the gold and only had a few of these left. So I picked this up. I love the bling bling stuff. When I get my nails done, I'm going to have them do them just like this. I may do the copper. Maybe because I don't want it to mess up. Um, not copper. What do you call that? chrome because i don't want that stuff to mess up my real nails because this shit on right here is so like on my real nails man that's why i'm not going to try to take it off i don't want it to mess up my real nails but i got to ask her and if she said i can do it i'm gonna get like the chrome just one accent nail the chrome like this one right here with that maybe this one yeah i'm gonna hook them up just watch 
and I'll let you guys see them. And I used to do that myself to my nails. I just don't have time. I get tired of doing all that stuff. But anyway, y'all, like I said, my favorite item is this right here. Simply, simply cute. I do have another plant that I bought. And what I will do is, show, is um, just put that on my um, community board. I be buying so much stuff, y'all, because I like stuff that looks so good. You know what I'm saying? I like everything almost not. I wouldn't say 100% perfect, but I do like stuff almost like that. And so this is why I like to. You know, take my time and decorate and just fix stuff the way I actually want it. Downstairs, I had to compromise because my daughter's them was like, you be doing too much. So I let them decorate and I just added certain things to it. And I'm going to keep it at a, it ain't going to be like real minimal, but it still is, you know, less than what I would normally do. And when I finish everything down there anyway, I'm just going to go down there and remove some things and basically keep it the way they had it. And one funny thing about downstairs, y'all, my curtains are not long enough. They made so many jokes about me being so damn cheap and wouldn't order no longer curtains. So, y'all, all them jokes and shit they did, man, I was like, let me order some um, curtains, okay? But y'all know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go right on Timu and order some long curtains for way cheaper. I guess they still cheap like that and get them shipped out. And once I get them, then I'll... um. Show y'all the window treatment. But when I do like a walkthrough, I'm probably not going to show. I may still show them. I don't give two craps. But uh, I probably won't show it, show them because I don't want no jokes. <laughs> With the short curtains. <laughs> you can't really tell behind the um, couch. But you can darn. You can you can definitely tell in the dining room area. They laugh so hard, y'all. They always be making jokes. They laugh so hard, man. I mean, they laugh so hard. It just made me realize, why do you have these short curtains in here? I mean, this is not no 84 inches. You know what I'm saying? Being cheap, trying to buy cheap curtains, you know, $9.99 special at Walmart. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm going to get some longer ones and put them up. There's so many damn windows in here. You're going to be broke as heck trying to put curtains everywhere. everywhere. But I'm not putting curtains everywhere. I'm going to put curtains right there. As y'all can see, excuse the stuff. And I'm going to put the curtains are downstairs, obviously, at two places. And then I'm going to do curtains in my bathroom, which I already, well, I probably need to get some longer ones for those too, that too. And then that's probably it with the curtains here. Everything else is going to be bare. You know, like the window is going to be bare. And, you know, and eventually I'm going to get me another computer desk and I got to get a chair because they was making fun about they was making fun of my chair. And then they came in my room and saw all this mess. And they was making fun about that, saying, there's no way you're going to win because you got too much stuff. You got to put all this stuff up. But they don't know, y'all. I'll be putting stuff up like I'm ready to do something right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to get ready to put some of these, this stuff in these drawers and stuff, you know, because they think they think I'm not going to be ready. I'm going to show them. I'm going to show them who to mess with, y'all. That's on everything. Much like I'm showing somebody else who to mess with, I'm going to show them who to mess with. I'm going to do it on a down low, undercover. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to work swiftly, smooth, and just be precise with what I'm getting ready to do. I'm going to tear them up. We'll see, though. I don't know about that. <laughs> but, we will... <laughs> but we will see, y'all. All right? So anyway, thank y'all so much for tuning in to Shay's Tube. Happy and blessed Easter. Easter weekend, Easter holiday. Don't forget the reason for the season. And y'all, don't forget to thumbs up this video. Subscribe to the channel. And hit that bell notification so you can get notify of any upcoming videos because I am not in the algorithm at all. Um, so I don't, I don't have enough views. So I can understand why, you know, so y'all, you know, share this video and get it out there because I do do some good content when I'm not cussing out a certain person. All right. And excuse me if you watch any one of those videos, but sometimes y'all, I'm going to tell you straight up, you got to let people know what's up. And I try to not do too much cussing or anything else because I'm trying to stop doing that, but I can still tell a person off anyway without even using any profanity. And so, but, um, Sometimes you do have to let people know what's up. You can't be letting people run over you, but know when to stop doing it. And and you probably won't see any more videos because of the um, legal stuff that I um, just filed and stuff and all the other stuff that I'm getting ready to do. It's just not a good look to keep on going back and forth when you're in legal situations. You know, you just file stuff, especially if you are the one that filed it and stuff. So you probably won't see any more videos. Now, you may hear a little, me making a little, you know, um, tripped out stuff. I may make comments, but it won't be about the him but you know you just you know just just laugh because it's funny and don't join in all right <laughs> y'all take care and i'll see you guys later again happy born day to all of my march babies i'm wishing you guys a long life and prosperity you know what i'm saying and so much happiness you know and just very 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 good health you know these areas out here don't be playing we just don't play y'all but we are happy people inside and out at least most of us well some of us all right so happy born day again to all the Aries and also to all the March babies. Because I don't know how far Aries go into. I think it goes into April as well. So y'all enjoy your day. And I'll see you guys later. Have a good and blessed weekend as well. And happy Easter. Peace out, y'all. This is Shades 2. All right now. Shades 2.
Let go. Yeah, yeah. This is Shades 2, and I'm back again. Bringing a brand new haul to all my friends. Been to all types of stores like DT and many, many more. Bringing you all types of deals that only Shay Shay calls substill. This is Shades 2, and I'm back again. This is Shades 2, and I'm back. Shades 2. And I'm back again. It's a shade too. And I'm back. All right now. It's a shade too. And I'm back again. It's a shade too. And I'm back. Like and subscribe. Yeah, yeah. Thanks y'all for tuning in. This is shade too. Yeah. I'm lit y'all. I'm lit for show. All right now, yeah, yeah, Shades 2.